The Omega Speedmaster Professional Moon Watch is probably one of the most iconic watches on Earth and in space. I'm fortunate to have a Speedy in my personal watch collection, and I often find myself trying on different straps to see if I can find new and exciting combinations. Omega's ingenious monochrome design turns the Speedmaster into an absolute strap monster, even on tropical rubber straps. If you don't believe me, stick around to the end. Starting with the Aurora lunar strap from Zulu Diver. This strap is faithful to the spirit of space exploration, and it's a must-have if you want a moonwatch, whether that's a Speedmaster or a Bulova. The black and grey complements the dial and keeps the muted aesthetic. The Zulu Diver is a really close copy of the original Gemini and Apollo straps and gives a proper vintage look to your moonwatch. Some people struggle with the style of the lunar strap, so that's why the Bond nylon strap is a perfect alternative. The armoured Zulu Diver Bond strap gives off the same vibe as the lunar strap in a more conventional nature style. But if that's still too flashy with those stripes, meet the Zulu Diver Ridge Strap in grey. Probably the most subdued option, but the plain colour makes the strap a classic and it's easy to pair with other watches too. Let's look at some more unusual choices, starting with the Watch Gecko V-Stitch perforated leather. The Speedmaster is a chronograph after all, so the racing style strap again is faithful to the design of the watch, and the quick release bars are a godsend. Next on the list is the simple handmade leather strap. This is a more vintage looking strap from high quality Italian leather. It is a simple strap, but it adds a bit of colour to your Speedmaster without being obnoxious. I'll be honest with you, this next strap is my second most favourite strap of all time, the Zulu Diver Mayday Sailcloth. It's incredibly durable and comfortable and there's quick release spring bars. Although my Speedmaster lugs are already quite badly scratched from years of changing, but if you've just bought a new Speedmaster then you can save yourself now from these scratches. This strap looks very like the Omega strap that came with the Dark Side of the Moon Special Edition, but it's a fraction of the price. Last but not least, the Watch Gecko Vintage Tropical Rubber. Even though the FKM rubber is often associated with diving, it's a perfect watch tool strap. The strap is also extremely hard wearing whilst being comfortable on the wrist. The grey adds interest but still keeps the muted design of your Speedmaster. If you have a special edition version, like the Dark Side of the Moon, then you can go more wild and select a yellow tropical strap even. Or if you have an Ultraman 2, then a red tropic would be another bold take. I hope some of these strap suggestions were helpful to you, but if you have found other cool Speedmaster combinations, please share them in the comments section. And if you like Omega watches, as I do, have a look at this video where I talk in depth about my titanium Omega Seamaster 300.